Alzheimer's is a neurodegenerative disease that affects more than 30 million people a year, slowly robbing them of memory, degrading their bodily functions and eventually killing them. Extensive examinations of the patient's brains show that the disease slowly destroys the neural network, which is so complex that we still do not know which chemical is responsible for it. According to one theory, a certain protein named Ta becomes defective, disrupting the normal function of neurons. Scientists in Slovakia report they have developed a vaccine that triggers the immune system to produce antibodies that effectively stop deterioration of the Ta protein. In our trials on, on, on animal models, transgenic animal models, we were seeing 95% of beta Tau removed within very short period. It was a very encouraging result. Scientists from Eli Lilly Pharmacological Company are trying a different approach, based on the theory that Alzheimer's disease is caused by abnormal deposits of a chemical called amyloid beta. Their new drug proved to be effective on patients with mild symptoms. There were no additional side effects. It's important because it showed a a continued effect of the drug, so the effects aren't, aren't transient, they aren't temporary. Results of the clinical trials of both drugs were presented at the recent symposium in Washington. Meanwhile, at Stanford University, researchers are probing the brain of the fruit fly, trying to fully understand neurodegenerative diseases. There is a lot of genes related to the human disease, and there are a lot of fly human disease model. That means you, you can uh, induce a lot of uh, symptoms. With the help of an infrared camera, a special robotic machine catches flies and prepares their brains for study without drugging the insects. As their neurons also contain ta proteins that can degenerate in the same way that happens in Alzheimer's, scientists say fruit flies are very useful subjects for lab researchers into the devastating disease. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.